I'm extremely happy to be selected as a uh, player of the month. Uh, I'm really grateful. Uh, but it's a, it's a team effort, you know. I want to uh, say thank you to everybody, uh, my teammates and the coaching staff. Uh, a lot of credit uh, go, to, uh, go to them. So I'm really grateful for uh, having those people around me this year. My personal goal uh, for this season is to score as many goals and as many assists as I can and also uh, help the team win a conference title. I have to be the leader of this team and as I'm one of the oldest players. So um, you know, every single game, I take a responsibility for uh, whatever happens you know, between the team. Yeah, well, from a leadership standpoint, Yos um, is 100% by example. Um, so he's, he's not necessarily the loudest of, of players or the most talkative of players. Uh, he just gets after it, and so um, it's difficult for any of his teammates uh, not to work, not to persevere, not to keep going. Anytime they look at him, they're seeing an excellent example. You know, I think for him to achieve his individual goals, he has to continue to make this and be a model of consistency, and that's his, his challenge. You know, it's nice this year that the reward is coming in terms of the stat sheet and goals uh, in particular, you know, just chances created. Sometimes his hard work uh, isn't easily recognizable. The, the goals put him in that spotlight and he deserves that. I know there's a couple of these were individual awards. Uh, we all recognize the fact that the individual doesn't get uh, the reward without the group suffering and certainly contributing. And energy allows us, I think, to, to keep morale up, keep momentum flying, and to feel good about our soccer. So, uh, it's very nice to be recognized. So well, my goal is to help players understand that and as always help them progress towards their, their individual goals.